Good morning, Lincoln Lions. Today is Thursday, May 20th. Happy Thursday. We have lots of birthdays today. Today, it's Grace Anderson's birthday. Happy birthday today, Grace. It's Aiden Bonella's birthday. Happy birthday today, Aiden. It's also Alessandra Rawls' birthday. Happy birthday, Alessandra. It is also Anaya Sorokin's birthday. Happy birthday today. Lots of birthdays. So exciting. Let's look and see what we have for lunch today. For lunch today we have ooh, the, oh, I was looking at the wrong date. I was looking at the 19th again. I thought, wait, I remember talking to somebody about the bean and cheese burrito yesterday. Okay, here's today's choice. Are you ready? It's a hot diggity dog or a deli sandwich and it's tater day. So hot diggity dog or deli sandwich and tater day. And tomorrow, just so you know, so you can plan if you want to have lunch here or bring yours from home, is a chicken patty sandwich and PB&J. All right, so those are your choices for tomorrow. Chicken patty sandwich or a PB&J. Let's see. I've got some more kind kids. Lots of good ones. Here's one for today. Um, Jude was kind because he gave me a bracelet that made my day. Respectfully submitted by Ella Rissa and Ms. Croson's class. Thank you, Jude, for being so kind and generous. All right. Looks like we have... Okay, oh, here's something that I think we've got lots of kids involved in. Okay, are you ready for it? Here it comes. Elizabeth in Miss Marshall's class is kind because um, could, her and Katrina in Miss Stoffel's class are both kind because they gave me a flower and are my friend and they are the kindest kids ever. And that was respectfully submitted by Bethany in Mrs. Trevathan's class. So super, super kind. Thanks for noticing that, Bethany. Here we go. We have Moses is kind because he helped me carry the ball bag. And that was submitted by Isabel in Miss Brabham's class. Thank you, Moses, for being helpful. And thanks, Isabel, for noticing that. And another one coming from Miss Brabham's class. Hunter is kind because when my crayons fell out, he helped me pick them up. And that was submitted by Harper. And again, in Miss Brabham's class. So thank you, guys. I'll make sure I put you in the drawing. We'll have one more drawing before the very end of the school year. I'll probably draw. Mm, I might start drawing tomorrow or Monday. Okay. All right. Our Mr. Brown's precept, our thinking like Lincoln for today, is I think a really important one as we get closer to the end of the school year. And it's for some of us harder and harder to make good choices and do the right thing. This is a really good reminder to help try to remember to do the right thing and make the best choice in the moment you're in. You're free to make your own choices, but you will never be free from the consequences of your choices. And I thought that's so important is you always have the ability to choose, right? But there are always consequences that come with those choices and you don't get to choose those always. So for example, if you're throwing food out in the outdoor eating area, that's a choice. And the consequences, you don't get to choose. And I can guarantee it includes losing, getting to eat outside, which is not fun. So make good choices and have positive consequences. Okay, let's stand for the flag salute. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day of learning, everybody.